Okay, we're going to need uh, one basic dude to consume. I don't really need a crazy amount of consumers. That's not gonna help me round one. And that's not what I want to play ever. <sighs> From hand. Okay, whatever. Drago Larva. Should I change the board? Because I'm kind of using the... Christmas board. With the Phantom Pigs. So, I would draw a Plague Maiden here. Oh, man. The sky will burn with the eternal fire! Okay, we can't play the Penitent right now. We gotta play the Haunt. Then the Penitent. I could've, uh... Yeah, I should've played in the front. Uh, they recently changed the Reinforced Trebuchet to be less dumb. Play the penitent. We gotta consume, and I think we're gonna use it. Okay, fine. Unfortunately, we don't have any bronzes to, to target. <clears throat> Team Shiny. Oh my god. Can you choose? Do I have those as well? I don't know. That's not gonna be great. We dance. <laughs> For young is the night. Uh, let's just go with Matahari. <laughs> Do not make me beg. Hey, Regadarak. Uh, we are playing the Red Raid deck. I was a little bit uh, considering what to play. But I really love this deck. And uh, yeah. We shall see if there are, there are going to be like any crazy new decks. But it, it doesn't seem like it. They just a little bit changed the game. Actually... So, we play the Plague Maiden in the front. Uh, I guess we're gonna play this in the back. And we eat the Plague Maiden. Well, now that's it. You like the White Pigs? Fuck yeah. I call them Phantom Pigs. Oh my god, see the project chat pot is already selling you guys card cakes, meteorite powder. Okay, cool. Oh no. We can't do much with it. Fall overboard and I'm not jumping in after you. Hmm. As long as we have a big unit, the beast is going to keep going up, so, I mean, yeah, I mean, the Bargus kind of looks like a beast. I mistook them for, uh, for a second. Okay. 
I can eat from the back. Do you have a favorite board? Or is this the uh, Phantom Pig board is, is acceptable? I can just change things, but I actually don't have a lot of uh, trinkets. I don't know how, how they are called in Gwent from the last few months at least. I actually didn't care too much about getting them. I, one thing that I, I kind of like is that people have these Team Shiny, Team Trist thingies. Uh, and I guess there's a team Yennefer one as well. What was your opinion on Runeterra? Oh, actually, I should have played that on stream. I actually did once. My opinion on Runeterra is that it's an okay game. Oh my god, I should be more specific. <laughs> it felt like a better Hearthstone. Well, I would... Well, the thing is, it kind of depends on how much I go into detail here. Because... It has six factions, and you can build a deck out of two factions, and basically you always, always, almost always want to. My my strategy, I kind of like the slow play of uh, Trellior. Kind of that's what I've tried to go for. But early on, I'm just gonna judge the game based on the meta it ended up having. And the early on, the meta mostly was dominated by uh, elusives and rush down elusives. And it didn't change that significantly when they released the patch. So I guess I, I have to keep judging the game based on that. Oh my god, we're getting scorched. Oh, we, yeah. God damn it. I don't mind it as long as... Okay. That's a better song. What was your opinion, guys? I think it's a good game, and I think I'm still gonna play it a little bit. But I don't know. Ultimately, I feel like maybe they can do a little bit more with the balancing. I want to see more of a long game strategy. And and I, I didn't really get that. It just felt like... A little, feel, feel, felt a little bit like I'm playing Hearthstone. If I, if I wasn't really rushed down early on, then I always won. And that's not really the same feeling I, I have in Gwent. In Gwent, you can be a lot more strategic. You need to keep that. It, it's a big question whether he's gonna force us. I don't know. I don't think he, he will. I like the Skirtel board. Let's go with the Harpy Egg. Oh no. Let's do Noon Braid. We're definitely not going for the default win condition. I never... I never was interested, maybe because of the universe. Uh, yeah, I don't care about the universe whatsoever. That's true. Like eggs. Hey, so the just, 
chilling with some Gwent. Oh my god. But I guess Gals needs to be played in the back anyway. Okay, let's go Abaya. Long time no see. Weird background. Who this? What do you mean? It's just, uh... I don't know. White background. <laughs> I couldn't think of anything witty to say. Shit, you guys might, must think of something. It's where the phantom pinks come from. It's kind of like the opposite of a black hole. I miss Pikachu in the back. He's dead. I'm looking for my new Pokemon. Maybe it's gonna be... I don't know, Shoop. What is the go-to uh, plush, miniature, whatever they're called to go and display on the stream? Or just go to bed with? I mean, we finally see you are just a simple AI program who forgot to turn on home background. <laughs> I, actually, my my wall looks a little bit whiter than usual because I had to turn on... I had to manually manage my exposure of my camera because of my black hoodie. I know this because I was streaming yesterday. And I was streaming a game and because of my black hoodie, my camera is just like, uh oh, I can't manage this. My camera is not the smartest, okay? Okay, let's put down that egg. But yeah, I could be an AI. Actually, we're getting to the point. I'm, I'm pointing fingers in the wrong direction, but off screen. But we're getting to the point where streamers might be able to get away with uh, replacing their face real time on this on this on this uh, stream. Imagine that! Imagine that! I can transform myself to a TV streamer, and I'm not only going to have very banter, but also nice looks, thousands of viewers. Fuck yeah! Also, I had to change my voice. I don't know. I think my voice is okay, but it's a sacrifice that I has to make I have to make. The observer button is like a second hat. The fuck? I might have to check that out. Uh don't eat that. Okay, pass. So, this guy really wanted to make sure that that's not gonna be a long round three, which is smart. But, is he correct? He could, he could be right, but we have a card advantage. Okay, some of these cards are not the best. Like, this guy is probably gonna be not the best. That is okay. That is okay too. So, we have a, a big combination of not much. We have an egg, we can trigger the egg, we can eat the egg, we can play this noon raid thing. Let's go with it. We can replay the egg as well. Sure. I think a big combination of not much is gonna be good enough. But we shall see. Uh, furry streaming would be on all time, <laughs> Rise, if we could, uh, we could change... What? Our looks on stream in real time. How, how would you guys trans uh, make me into a furry? Is like wearing bunny bunny ears uh, would be acceptable? Is that good enough? Yeah. Now, when I first made this deck, 
I was owning people big time, everybody, because all the suckers were passing against me. But somehow, everybody knows now, and they're like, oh shit, this is the rat trade deck, I gotta go all in first two rounds. So we gotta be smart about it. So instead of doing our regular win condition, we just take a card advantage, and we beat them with points. So, in a way, I consider this a loss because they just make me boring. I, I wanna... I want to win by filling their board with rats, but they make me win by some boring point game that they all play. Whatever, GG.